What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be unboxing a model that I got on sale from Easy Toys. Without further ado, let's get started. Wait, I actually forgot. Hugh, wait. Oh! Engine models, wait. Oh! So, uh, I actually didn't know, but in this box, there are two, uh, models. Now... I did order, uh, the, uh, the model that I did get on sale was the, uh, Lult 788, uh, but what also came in the box was the, uh, NG Models American 737-800 in the astronaut livery. Uh, now, I actually didn't know this was in the box because of the fact that I did order this, uh, with a, uh, second release, second edition Her Out Here California NG Models, and so, apparently, since that one... Is on pre-order and they're not going to ship it for a while. I believe they just put the uh, American 77-800 Astrojet with it. So that's actually pretty nice. That's actually a pretty nice thing that uh, Easy Toys did. But uh, yeah, since this has now turned into a two-model unboxing, I think we're going to start with the smaller model and then we're going to move on to the bigger model. And now let's take a look at uh, the box. So taking a look at the uh, NG Models American Astrojet 77-800. On the top we have uh, the type of aircraft, we have the clip out of the aircraft, and we have this um, AA, the retro AA logo. Now I believe if you put this next to the 757-200 uh, box, either 7, I think it was the 757-200 box, uh, the logos do line up uh, of the Astrojet livery, so that's actually pretty cool. But uh, yeah, here we have uh, American Airlines Astrojet. We have this stripe, the registration, which is the number 905 November and 905 NN, uh, the NG Models logo, one to four to scale collectible model. And on the side, it's pretty much the usual with the NG Models logo, the aircraft, the registration. And on the front, instead of the clip art, we have uh, the airline clip art of the aircraft. And on the other side, it's the same as the other side. And on the back, of course, you just have the same design as on the front. And of course, we have all the uh, liability, Instagram, and stuff like that. But, um, or social media. And, uh, yeah, so this whole entire box is coated, or not coated, painted, or, cup. what's the word? Um, the whole box is sort of in this gray design. And you know what? I'm grooving it. I like it. But, uh, yeah, now let's unbox the model. So, uh, before going on to the detail segment for the small, uh, American 738, um, let's take a look at the Lot 788. So, we'll put this over to the side, uh, and said. And now let's unbox this. So this is a Phoenix model. Uh, while the American 738 Astrojet, I did get that at normal price, 48 bucks. This one was on sale for 29.99. Uh, so obviously I had to go for it. Now obviously both American and Lot Fly to Newark. Lot Fly um, near 788 on uh, normal scheduled service from Warsaw to Newark, and then over the summer they fly from Dresho, uh to Newark. But um, yeah, meanwhile American flies to Charlotte and a bunch of other destinations from Newark using their 737-800. So yeah, now let's take a look at the box. Taking a look at the box, it's pretty generic. Uh, there's nothing really special about it. Uh, Boeing 787-8, the lo logo is kind of in a lighter uh, black while there, it has this black design on the front. And you have the clip out of the aircraft. Now, this aircraft is in the Olympic liver, I believe it is. And uh, yeah, you have the black stripe and then a white stripe. Uh, you have the airline, the registration. It's in 1-400 to scale. And then on this side, you just have the warning, the barcode. Uh, and then on the white side of the box, you have a clip out of the aircraft, Boeing 788, 1-400. And then on the front, uh, it's continuing the black design going up towards the front and the back, uh, 788, the clip art, 1-400. And it's actually interesting. I like what they did with this box. The white stripe goes from the two sides of the box, while the black goes over the top and towards the back. Wait, this is trippy. Uh, <laughs> goes towards the back, which is... Um, here and then the same goes with the red which goes back here but uh yeah now let's unbox it the model has a, a bit of a problem here we have a paint chip uh and then on the other side the the paint is sort of smudged but that's not really a big problem because i mean overall the model is intact but uh yeah let's put that off to the side let's put the packaging off to the side and now let's get on to the detail segment for the American 738 and then move on to the Lot 788. 
Starting off with the detail segment, for this model we have the cockpit windows, Astrojet titles, L1 door, tiny tiny One World logo, and we have the forward landing gear, and this massive orange stripe going across the whole fuselage, as well as the American Airlines titles in blue once again extending across the whole entire fuselage. Now continuing on down the aircraft to the wings, we have the emergency exits, uh, antenna, Wi-Fi hub slash HUD, another antenna, and here in the chrome before the L2 door, we have American flag and the registration, which is November 905, November, November. And of course, we have the L2 door and the tail, which says the words Astrojet and AA, in uh, Amer which is just Americans' old uh, livery before they switched uh, to, I believe... Yeah, they're chrome, which was just another version of that. Now, uh, moving on to the other side of the aircraft, the only difference is you have two cargo doors here on this side of the aircraft uh, versus the other side, which has uh, no cargo doors. Um, now, the chrome, I thought this was actually going to look like Gemini's, which kind of looked like Gemini only did a half hour's job on it. But um, this is really, really good and yeah on the bottom you have two antennas but other than that it's a pretty good model the chrome ng models have done phenomenal on this it, it's really reflective as you guys can see here on the camera so yeah ng models you guys did a really good job on this and of course it is a 737-800 and like i said now like i said before uh ng models do fly to many destinations with the 737-800 from newark they fly to chicago charlotte and i believe even sometimes they go all the way down to miami with it but that's only 737 max usually but uh yeah that does conclude the detail segment and now let's move on to the lot 77-8 Starting off with the detail segment for this lot 788, we have the cockpit windows, Starlines logo, uh, little Olympic logo, L1 door, forward landing gear, lot titles in blue with of course a little tiny paint chip, but obviously that's not no very noticeable, so obviously I don't really care about that. But uh, yeah, moving on down the aircraft, we have the L2 door, uh, an antenna, Wi-Fi hub slash HUD, Polish Airlines following the LOT logo. We have the words LOT, L-O-T on the engines. Continuing on down the line, we have the L3 door, the words proud to fly the Polish Olympic team. And uh, moving on down the line, we have the words Dreamliner. Uh, is that chip too? Yeah, anyway, continuing on down the aircraft, we have the words Dreamliner, partially smudged. Uh, the words proud to fly the Polish Olympic team uh, and this sort of little Polish flag Olympic design. And moving on down the aircraft, we have the L4 door. Uh, we have some antennas, the words Boeing 787E, uh, and the registration of the aircraft, which is Sierra Papa Lima Romeo Hotel, SPLRH, the tail, which is in Lot's logo and has a little Polish flag. Uh, yeah, the only difference uh, between the left side and the right side is on the right side, you have uh, a tiny cargo door here, but that is a very, very subtle detail that you're not really going to see. And yeah, here, I'll try to focus it for you guys. There's another smudge. There. There's a lot of smudges on this model, and this wasn't done by me. Like, I just unboxed this five minutes ago, and seeing that there is smudges and stuff like that that really does not give me confidence in ng or not ng in phoenix models quality and uh yeah obviously the landing gear have this uh sort of silver ish design and on the bottom there's uh obviously one or two antennas and yeah that does conclude the detail segment for these two models but uh yeah that being said that does conclude this video if you guys like the video please like subscribe and turn on notification bell to my videos and comment down below uh, what you guys think I should improve my videos and if you guys have any of these models in the unboxing But uh, yeah, once again, thank you for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next video as always goodbye